In this video, we will look at a few more new options that have been added to the SoundCloud element that can be used in both Brizzy WordPress and for Brizzy Cloud. Remember to give us a thumbs up liking this video and also subscribe to this YouTube channel for more videos like this. I have two columns here and the reason I have two is because I want to show you how you can bring in a SoundCloud, well, just a song, a track, and then a playlist because the options that you have will differ for the two. To work with SoundCloud, you go to the audio element, and this is going to work exactly the same for WordPress and Cloud. And by default, it will bring in a track that is preloaded. To bring in your own track, select the little speaker icon here, and then you're going to paste the link here. I'll hop on over to SoundCloud, and here I have a track. So all I'll do is click on Share, and then here, select that, copy that, and then go back here to where the link is, select everything, and then paste that and it will update it very quickly. Now you have all the other options here, like which style do you want to use? If you want to have a big cover in the back, and this one is more preferable if you are working with playlists. So let's go back to this style option here. Now under advanced, you're going to get a abundance of options, basically toggling certain views on or off. Do you want the artwork? No, and then the artwork goes away. You also have like button, buy button. You will see there's a little buy button, the download button, if you can download it, and then the share button. And all of these are very simple. They're just on and off functions for your SoundCloud track that you can give more control or take away that control from the visitor. Let's do this again. And this time we're going to bring in a playlist so that you can also be aware of the fact that you can work with a playlist. And like before, you go to the audio setting here in the SoundCloud element or the audio element. And this time we go to playlists. Instead of selecting share, just click on copy link. Let's go back, select everything, and then paste the link. And voila, very easy. You have the playlist there as well. Let's put it on the cover view. So you can see now you have the playlist dropping down here at the bottom. And then like before, you have these options and you will notice that some of them won't be applicable here because the playlist is structured differently, but that others like the share button, comments, play counts and username, these can also be toggled on or off. Those are the settings within the SoundCloud slash audio element. Give it a spin in Brizzy WordPress or Brizzy Cloud.